My name is Jeremy Childs, and I play Mr. Riley in the committee. And they've uh, given me a few minutes to sort of talk about what's on my heart and on my mind, which is always an incredibly dangerous thing, but they can always edit. So um, I, it's sort of with a heavy heart that I, I come in here today. I, I tend to sort of jump into humor to try to compensate for heavy feelings sometimes, which doesn't always work out the way I want it to. But um, this has been, I've been doing this for a long time. And this is the first gig that I've ever had that has uh, lasted this long. And I think the longest gig I had uh, previous to this was maybe six months. And uh, so I've never, it's, it's been a while since I've uh, had the opportunity to sort of uh, adopt a, a professional family, if you were, uh, if you will. And over the last year, year and a half, um, I've had some real special times. I love Mr. Riley, I love the character. I sort of, I'm a big fan of Carol O'Connor and Jackie Gleason, so that sort of was my template. And when I was trying to figure out exactly, you know, the, the love-hate thing with Riley, trying to figure all that out. And that's been a joy. That's what an actor loves to do, uh, is sort of figure out a character, develop uh, a life for that character. But what's been sort of the biggest surprise for me are the, uh, the relationships that I've formed. As I get older, I tend to find that although the work is important, um, the relationships become more important the older I get. So to be presented with an opportunity where I actually get to develop relationships with people that I like, because it's rare to work with a group of people for even six months and there not be some kind of ego problem. And these are things that I've not only not had to worry about, but it's, it's the first time I think I've ever seen a cast and crew come together to form this sort of, I don't know, a family seems cheesy, but it's the best thing I can think of. From the Pisonis, see, I worked you in, the Pisonis, uh, to, to Nick and John, the sound department, of course. Uh, what can I say about Steve and Tim? Tim, who I just recently met, but Steve, who I've been working intently with for the last year and a half. This, what, what people need to understand, this is difficult, okay? Having a series that is half teaching tool, not only a teaching tool, but they have a certain agenda that they have to meet in a script. So it's half teaching tool, it's half narrative. Thank you to the committee, thank you to everybody out there who, who takes the time, takes 15, 20 minutes every month, you know, to sit down and watch what we're doing and to be involved with the characters and be involved with uh, what's going on to Park Grove. And I'll miss Park Grove and I'll miss everybody involved. And thank you. Thank you very much. Woo! All right. <laughs>